Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Kim Kardashian has four children with Yee, formerly known as Kanye West. North, Saint, Chicago, and Slum West. They are featured a lot on her Kardashian series and Instagram. Kim has been all over the media world for years, mostly because of her hit reality Kardashian show, Keeping Up With The Kardashians. Furthermore, Kim's children are very young and have already been quite exposed to this socialite lifestyle. Now, Kim has driven the launch and allowed her eight-year-old saint to have a YouTube channel. In her Instagram story, Kim wrote, I finally allowed Saint to have a YouTube channel after signing an extensive contract. The contract was pictured for everyone to see. Also, she added, please subscribe. Along with the username for the channel, The Goat Saint. With his mom's help, Saint's YouTube went from 813 subscribers to 10,500 in just a single day. One of the lines from the contract reads, I must show my mom or guardian all videos before I post them. Another states, I am not not allowed to film while North is recording music. Hopefully, the double knot is an accident, and she's not pinning her children against each other. Additionally, it states, I am not allowed to film any personal information. Even P.O.P.L. Magazine made a response to the contract. However, they claimed it was a joke. Kim clapped back, further stating that it wasn't a joke and she was prepared to do arbitration. Parenting specialist Kirsty Ketley has taken her opinion on Kim's decision to the son. Ketley said that Kim is being an irresponsible parent by allowing this. Moreover, Ketley believes the allowance of this channel will lead to risky behaviors. Ketley worries about the lengthened screen time and the effect it could have on the growing boy. She went on to tell The Sun that according to the American Academy of Child and Adolescent Psychiatry, children between the ages of 8 to 12 already spend 4 to 6 hours of their day in front of screens and teens spend up to 9 hours. Ketley expresses that the damage and potential harm around this issue is no secret to anyone as it has spent much time being reported on. She believes the harm can impact sleep, behavior, and self-esteem. With their family in such a spotlight, it will encourage other children to want to do the same. Ketley cautions parents to think deeply about the decision to let their children into the internet and social media worlds. Moreover, despite this contract, Ketley does not believe an eight-year-old is mature enough to avoid all the dangers that come with social media. This is especially because the minimum age for social media is 13 years old. Ketley believes the privacy saint might have had is now gone, and it is just another example of Kim allowing her kids to get their way and grow up too fast. Due to his mom's posting, Ketley believes it's more likely that he is getting followers because of who his mom is rather than his videos.